Welcome to Couple of Instigators, and I'm here with Genro. No. <laughs> Jenny. Yes. Ra Jenny. Romero. Romero. Okay, I'm totally struggling with her name, but that's because I'm an idiot and we all know that. <laughs> so there's no no other reason to bring Call me up. whatever you want, darling. I don't mind. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm so glad to have you. Uh, we met in a comedy class. Uh, you do stand up in the city and I love you. And <laughs> we are going to get into all of my questions for you. And... I have Lauren, who I haven't seen over the Zoom in ages. I am very upset that she has extra tickets to Fortune, Feimster. Um, Yeah. And I can't get there. She is in Columbus. Oh, damn. That's I know. Gonna be a great and the show. tickets are front row, like front, table. front table. Well, it's technically second. It's like front table is on the stage, and where the sports table is behind it. Amazing. Yeah. And, and we'll she's, be making eye contact. Oh, yeah. for sure. And she's just <laughs> posting on social media. Anybody want to come? I have two tickets. And I'm just like, <laughs> seriously, if I didn't have a million things to do, I would be fucking driving there to go to the show with Lauren. And we would have yeah. fun, motherfuckers. Fun. <laughs> for sure. Yes. And Mel, I just saw Mel. Uh, we hung out quite a bit while she was she was in town. She's her family's from up here. Okay. And uh, she was very, very kind and came to a couple of my shows while she was here. Right, Mel? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Six weeks with my family. So we yeah. must tell General that Dr. Google, who is Dr. Google? <laughs> oh, yes. Tell me. Dr. Dyson, right? Dyson, that's right, Dyson. Dr. Dyson. So uh, any, I, I, I'm not very smart, okay? Not at all. And I, I don't pretend otherwise, but I don't know anything. And uh, Lauren ha Googles everything in like a hot second. And she is Dr. Dyson because she had a Dyson hanging up on the wall behind her. And Mel thought she was a doctor. She was in her office and it was like a blood pressure cuff. Oh my God. Oh, that's her patient screen. Look at it, right, General? She's got that screen. I thought, is it going to be somebody coming up with it? It was what? like on a solid wall and it had the wire hooked up. I had to take it down, but. Um, yeah. Yeah. She's like, I thought, cool. I thought you just pushed your curtain over and we're recording from like your <laughs> patient's room. I thought, are we going to see somebody's ass in the. <laughs> somebody in a hospital now just be like, nurse. yeah, nurse. <laughs> <laughs> Nurse. but it is appropriate though because lauren can google a bitch in a minute okay oh, that's awesome so i actually appreciate that because sometimes i'm too lazy to that's bad i'm too lazy to google shit it's like the most convenient technology i'm like nah, i'll just keep guessing like, I'll just, just keep saying shit wrong. I will yeah, say the yeah. whole wrong story before I will pick up my phone and Google <laughs> that shit. Okay. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. But yeah. So um, Mel, did you come? What did you come to my? What show did you come to? Well, let's see. Everything's a blur. Uh, I I came to your show. You opened up for Rachel Feinstein. Yes. You hold it for Rachel Hosted. Feinstein. And then did my you cousin come? Kelly Spurino and I. Yes, that's right. Did you, did, you didn't come to the Pride show, right? No, but we, I, I okay. saw you open mics, some open mics up in Rochester. Okay. That's no, I missed the Pride show. I didn't have to. Okay. Yeah, your internet's sketchy, Mel. Um, okay, so Lauren. <laughs> What has been going on with you in the last, you know, I don't how, oh my God, five weeks? It's like, awesome. surely you got to be close to getting laid. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, I have no good stories to tell. <laughs> like, what happened to Vax Girls Summer here? What is I going know, on? I, uh, yeah, I'm, it's like the end of summer. Mel's going back to school and I am, I don't even have it figured out yet. Um, <laughs> uh, I have a dog. Oh, you've got another dog. She, he is getting adopted tomorrow. Someone is driving from Chicago. 
Okay. To meet him. He's a shoe in like, they're going to love him. Um, he's so amazing. So this, this will be my last who as a foster dog mom for a while. You keep saying that. Famous and then last words. <laughs> no action on the dating apps. Hey. Uh, I haven't really set up my profiles. Oh, I, I just don't even know what to put on there. So are we, what are we going to go into like cold, uh, winter girl? I don't, how do we, what do we? Cuffing uh, season. Uh, yeah. I mean, what? Cuffing. Is that what they call it? <laughs> Wait, yeah. Cuffing? When it starts getting cold, you want to cuff. Like summer, it's hot. Sleep with whoever you want. You see a dick, you suck it. Or yeah. a pussy. <laughs> Uh, in the winter you you gotta you gotta cuff you know and so it's it's a solid you keep that one because you need christmas gifts right right i mean there's shit that you need to have right for sure thanksgiving oh are you are you dating anyone i mean everybody and then you bring the fucker you're like this is the guy they got this for now (laughs) <laughs> that's, that's giving that's, us live action uh emojis yeah yeah <laughs> you know, I just, I just hey you know what what apps do you use dating apps what dating apps yeah what lauren's using are, are you too general um tinder but i like i don't know i barely go on it i swipe i, I don't know if you guys knew this with tinder if you swipe right to everyone which like, I do. Oh my god, that's awesome! That is awesome. <laughs> Jenny, like one of these motherfuckers, like will respond. Fuck? Yeah, exactly. He's <laughs> ugly. He needs attention. Oh Perfect. my god, I'm gonna start doing that. Yes, swipe right to everyone. Um, but then there's a limit. At one point, Tinder will message you, and you're like, "You reached your limit for the day." <laughs> Lock you out you, for the day. You, you reach your limit to um, the amount of dicks you can like. Exactly. <laughs> your dick hours, no more swipes. <laughs> you got to fish through the, all the dicks that you said yes to, and then you work. You go from there. Well, your pool has got to be huge if oh. you put fifty mile radians because you're in Queens, so you're yeah. fucking covering. Brooklyn, Manhattan, you're going to Staten Island. I mean, you yeah. are, you like. <laughs> I'm on the map, baby. That <laughs> everywhere for you. Oh, yeah. The Bronx, even. The I'll Bronx, right. I'll fucking yeah. do it. You'll fucking do I mean, it. I've done it. <laughs> General has done the Bronx. <laughs> Literally Gen- from the Bronx, the whole yeah. Bronx. <laughs> General from the Bronx, isn't there? There's yes. a song we could just Jenny say. Jenny from the Block. That's yes. what I'm naming this. this. General <laughs> from the Block is the name of this podcast. <laughs> oh my, that's it, Cindy, right? Yeah, that's what I'm naming it. There Fuck you go. that, I'm writing a bit for her about it. Yes. <laughs> like, it really, it. though, you that could be a funny fucking bit as if you did like you, you know, this is how desperate I am. Yeah, I swiped right so long that Tinder's like, you're fucking cut off today. You have looked <laughs> no at way dick. too much dick today. You are done. Yes. Yeah. It, 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 that's literally what they told me. And I was like, I'm not done. I'm not done. Like, as soon as the ban is up, they're like, okay, you can start swiping. I'm like, here we go. Boom. Just like, yeah, get that finger working. <laughs> I'm a psychopath. Well, you know, I fucking love you. <laughs> I love you too. Your faces. Thanks, look, Thanks. her faces during class, Lauren. I <laughs> just, I, th- it's just the whole fucking class. I, I just look at her and I, between you and Jessica Curse, like both of your faces, I, I just sit there and laugh in my box. It's like the, it's like the fucking Brady Bunch, right? And everyone's in a big square, and I just came between the two of you, and I'm laughing at the most inappropriate shit. Like someone could be telling a horrific story, like, I, I, I like that one. One of them was just like talking about, like you know, her. She does some jokes about her infertility, and but she, you know what I mean. But she was not. I shouldn't have laughed, and I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> because 
Okay, excuse me. Like, sometimes Cindy is under the influence after 10 o'clock. Well, yeah, no, there's uh-huh. that too. <laughs> well, there you go. There's that too. But I'm that so help. I'm so slow, Jenny, that when <laughs> some people tell jokes, I'm so like literally dumb that I have like a five minute reaction sometimes and I'll just be like thinking about what they said and I'm just like oh <laughs> like it's not funny like, and I do it at comedy clubs too like if I'm at a club watching a show yeah. and someone will say something and and then they'll say it won't even be the punch and I'm fucking laughing from the first punch because I finally got it <laughs> like I'm not okay with smart comedy like that's not good I kind of, I get that though, because I've laughed too early. Like, you're doing like you knew still. it's coming, right? Yeah. And I really, the setup is just funny. And I'm just like, ah. and then people, it's quiet. And my laugh is like, I'm like, ah. you know, people are like, all right, that wasn't it. I'm like, and the ah. best is when I'm anticipating like a punchline because I kind of get what they're lining up and right. I'm thinking I'm ready. And it's not like they completely <laughs> eat the shit. And I'm like, yeah. that was a horrible punch. Like, what the fuck are you doing? Like, I want to just, yeah, it's. <laughs> uh, I watch, a, I go to a lot of comedy, way more than I'm in. I, I go. Um, I'm a, just, I feel like no matter what, like I'm always learning something, you know, and oh, I really love yeah. to watch the crowd every show. So half the time, if I'm watching the headliner, I'm like, Oh, they got that person to laugh. I didn't think that would happen. You know what I mean? I'm yeah. so busy, like trying to get the whole audience reaction, which is probably why I completely overthink my my shit sometimes. You know, because I I spend so much time paying attention to things that don't fucking matter. I kind of get that though. You want to gauge the room. Mm-hmm. Like I like to scan the room before. Like if I'm, am I are you, right? Yeah, of course. You want to see what right? people are laughing at. You're like. All right, she's a she's got a nerdy sense of humor. That guy doesn't think it's funny. He's probably into smart humor. And then I'm just like, eh. People are like, all right, it's mixed. You know, like, I mean, comedy's so like specific. It's like food, right? Like, yeah. It's not, oh, what's the best? Like, yeah. People, people like what they like. It's very specific, you know. Right, so, right. Oh, absolutely. I agree. You know, I mean, everyone's always like, who do you think is the best comic, you know? And I mean, there's always the Chappelle. You could throw out, you know, the some of those names, but you're right. I mean, there's probably a ton of people that, and I don't love Chappelle, but motherfucker's funny. Yeah. He's a good writer. Yeah. He's, he's a great. good storyteller. And he like hits those marks. Hell yeah. You know what I mean? He could read the most unfunny joke, but he could make it. But yeah, it's tough. Like, I don't think I'm not a love and love Nikki Glacier. And she's killing it right now. Oh, I, I love her actually. <laughs> you do see yeah. you love her stand up. Like I yeah. couldn't get banging. I couldn't relate to that. So it's personal again, it's like, you know, yep. like food or music. Like, yeah, what's the best band? You're like, I like, I like old white people music. I like like Rolling Stones and the yeah. Beatles, you know, I don't know, but that's not for everybody. Some people are like, right. I like, I don't know, fucking Lady Gaga. Lip like Biscuit. But, or the yeah, Insane Lip Clown Posse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I see one of them. Oh, that was Slipknot. I was like, some Slipknot. one of the guys died. Oh, right. That was like oh. recently. Yeah. I got Slipknot and ICP confused because I surprisingly listened to both in high school for a period of time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you t- it's like me and my Gap jeans and my limited two shirts, <laughs> listening to like Limp Biscuit and Corn and ICP. You are a oh, you are hardcore. <laughs> did you like Rage Against the Machine? I did. Yeah. I mean, I listened to a lot. I mean, I've been a like a music snob all my life. So yeah. Well, yeah. Guess who she who um, she we have in common? We love oh. Taylor Swift. Ooh, we're Swift. Oh, T Swift. Okay. I never got into her. I, I, yeah. I'm trying. No, gotta, don't. You'll get hurt. Just stay away. She's not for you. If you can't get her all at once, it's going to be yeah. tough because Taylor's not for everybody. Yeah. I Mel- 